I bought the cows to reinvigorate my soil. But because such a small flock would not be profitable if I sold it to a butcher, I had come up with the idea of selling the meat in my own restaurant. And on that front, I'd had another brainwave. Chilies. Right. Whatever he is. Oh, oh, oh. My plan was to grow them so I could sell chili chutney in both the restaurant and the farm shop. Clever, eh? I'll do. That's it, it goes like that. There. So Caleb and I built two polytunnels. And then I had to choose what sort of chilies to grow in them. This is a habanero, which on the Scoville heat scale scores between 150,000 and 325,000, which means it's pretty damn hot. Mmm. That's pretty nice, actually. Now, that was 150,000 thereabouts on the Scoville scale. This one, this is a Naga, this is 1.3 million. Oh, OK. Right. Hmm. Hmm. Nice. Oh! <laughs> Holy shit. That's really hot. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, excuse me. Um, that's just some sick, sick coming up. Oh, oh, dear. Oh, my God, what are you doing? What have you got? That might be a bit too hot. Do you want to try a bit? Go on, then. What's it called? Naga. Naga. You know, you've got to chew it ten times before you swallow it, otherwise it burns your stomach. Yeah. Oh, fuck, that's hot already. <laughs> Bit of a cake, hasn't it? <sighs> your arse in the morning is going to look like the Japanese flag. <laughs> <laughs>